It's a good initiative, there's no doubt about that. And it's good for the sport. We've been talking about the boxing is dying. I think this is something that is going to revive boxing. In fact, it is going to revive boxing. You've already seen inside there when the matchmaking, it was open to everybody. It's not something that has been done to close doors. It's just right in front of everybody. And the excitement that it, it was sort of like everybody was having because people know them boxers and they know good fights. Already when some they were praying for one boxer to fight the other boxer amongst the boxers they know. So it was a good thing and it promises to be uh, it's going to be a good, 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 uh, sort of like an, an, an... That's what I've been thinking about, because when you talk about that term, Iminyolo, it's, it's something that has been... The promoters, the, then prom the promoters outside the, the league, something that they, they're still using it even right now, and that's one of the things that is killing boxing. But this that has come up with, 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 with Dixie, it's going to change all that, and it's going to put the promoters under pressure, because now you're talking about boxers fighting for big money right here. Mm. You're talking about boxers getting activity. You're talking about boxers getting quality fights here. And they ain't going to wait for a queue of one promoter having so many boxers so he don't know when he's going to fight. It's up to the boxer if he wants to carry on up to the final. The final is for the big prize. You know, how he take care of, takes care of himself. So I think this is going to give a lot of problems to the, the promoters themselves. They're going to have to up their socks. And they, they're not going to be sort of like relaxing as they, they've been doing. So it's good. It, it, this is a good initiative. Personally, I'm very happy, you know, because we've been, you know, thinking about this thing, you know, because when you think of us, welcome later, the bottles, you know, we used to bring that hype in boxing but ever since we left boxing you know there was no uh, entertainment that the people can 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 talk about boxing even before before the fight even before the tournament starts you know and and i think the the, the ppl is coming up with this uh, uh, concept and and it's brilliant and it's good for 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 boxing fans it's good for boxing when I came here and I saw that boxing lovers, that whole thing changed my mind. You know, that now we are going back now where we, we used to, you know, pack in the stadiums, in the halls where, where boxing is happening. You know, where you, you used to see the couples coming in, in boxing and, and watch these, these boys, you know. So I think, I think it, this is a very, very brilliant uh, uh, concept that Dixie came up with. Boxing lovers know these boys. I think the most entertaining thing is to see these boys because fighting each other. The matchmaking of, of this PPL uh, tournament it's, it's going to take uh, boxing lovers to watch what they've been looking for all these years. This is very important. You know, when I used to go to America, it's when I, I, I saw that boxing is a business. You know, how they treat their world champions. It's totally different here at home, you know, because when you are a world champion, it's, it's business. You've got an entourage and there's big money. So what PPL is doing is, is changing the face of boxing, you know, because there's money involved and everybody now is, is going to follow the PPL. It's not about a new trainer being better than the ex-trainer, but I just, I just need a change, you know. I've been working with Nick Grant for six years and it's a, it's a, it's a new thing now, you know. Uh, we call it PBL. Uh, there's a one million thing. So uh, I decided, no, let me let me just go back home where my roots are. When they teach, where the, there are those guys who teach me this from the start, from scratch. You know, I think those guys can can take me to my A game. So yeah. And welcome Nita offers that. Uh, welcome Nita is gonna be a part of the team, but he's not my trainer. But he will be the part of the team. I can assure you. I think that's one of the most important thing in that PBL asks you to come and perform on this stage for six rounds only and it keeps you active so you're guaranteed three fights inside PBL but you can still continue with your program you know we're not looking to disrupt what your promoter and manager has worked out for you you know so we work with those managers and those promoters through through PSA as an understanding that if you have a, uh, a mandatory to deal with uh, you are a champion and number one 
the number one boxer needs to be fighting you, um, we are going to position you in the league in a way that's not disruptive to that process. Um, so that means a lot of work. Uh, we work with BSA uh, weekly, you know, um, and, and uh, it's not easy. It's, it's, it's got to be done.